right? So this demonstration that I'm going to show you is all about how you can stop more slowly to stay, to stay safe. And I you so we've kind of got this little pocket, all right? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a raw egg, no tricks here, it's a real raw egg, and I am going to throw it as hard as I possibly can at Luna and Jacob. Now, ordinarily, when you throw an egg really hard and it hits something, what happens? deceleration and so wear your bike helmet when you ride so that you will stay like the egg in the demonstration you'll stay full not like this egg but not like that egg. i'd like to introduce you to dr david keswick he's the medical director of the columbus division of fire who is really the ringleader i think for this uh, today's activity as well as all the activities this week for ems and fire and safety and he's going to do a quick cpr demonstration for you here we go dr keswick can do a lot of great things to help to save lives and take care of people that are ill or injured. So that's what EMS Week is about today. We're kicking it off. This is the first day of the week. We have a lot of demonstrations here. So before we break up, I wanted to ask if there's anybody here who doesn't know how to do CPR. Raise your hand if you don't know how to CPR. Okay, who would like to learn? It takes some time. So in that time interval, if more of us here in this community can learn how to do CPR, more lives will be saved. Are you ready to learn? Yeah. Okay. Good. Now you don't have to be real, you know, a road scholar or anything like that. You just have to be able to pump on the chest. Do you think you can do that? There. And then you lock your other hand on top through the fingers. And then you basically press down about a one inch to two inches, somewhere in between. And on this mannequin, it gives a nice kind of clip whenever you do it. And you know the best rhythm to do this to, anybody know the song that you're supposed to think of in your head? Stay in alive. This is Council Member Michelle Mills. And Council Member Mills is the chair of our safety committee. And she's also the executive director of the St. St. Stephen's Community House. Is that right? Council Member Mills. Thank you very much. It is good to be here. Uh, I won't keep you long because I know that you have much more exciting things to do when it comes to coming to Coastside. But I want to say thank you for coming because this is how our work gets done. We can't be everywhere, all the places. We have thousands of individuals. We do over 116,000 runs to save lives in Columbus. And that's a lot. And we've transported over 56,000 individuals when necessary. But what really helps us when we arrive at a house to avoid some of that and to make sure that lives are safe is that you all learn important lessons that you're learning here today. So if next year is the time that you bring family or you engage at CPR or other life-saving techniques that you can learn throughout the year, we really would appreciate it because it is in partnership with you all that we can save the lives of all of our citizens in Columbus. Hey, okay, we put all this stuff on to protect us so that we don't get burned to the fire. Well, you know, stitches are easy because we can fix the skin, but we can't fix your brain disease. 
Are you going to my shoulder? Handles hanging over. Uh, 911, the importance of 911, when to call, when not to call. Smoke detector. So we teach them all that, and then once we, we get through all that, we'll teach them about when their house is on fire, how the smoke stays up here, the heat stays up here. We'll have them line up and we'll have them start crawling through the back side where we have all the smoke. See here? and then make their way out the back door and get outside to an area we call the meeting spot. Now we got a cone set up outside today, so when they go through, we'll have a meet out there. Everybody gathers there, we get a count, or whoever's with them, mom, dad, teachers, they get a count, let us know that everybody's there, and that's what we do in a fire. Scene. Oh,